All right, welcome back. So in this video, we're going to talk about inheritance. So inheritance allows us to define a class that inherits all the methods and properties from another class. Parent class is a class being inherited from, also called base class. Child class is the class that inherits from another class, also called derived class. Use the super function. Uh, to use the super function, I should say, Python also has the super function that will make the child class inherit all the methods and properties from its parents. So now let's jump into the code and take a look at this. All right, so let's create a new folder for this. So let's do new Python 3 notebook. And then we're going to label this 15, okay, and then inheritance. So let's do 15 inherit. Attempts. There we go. And we're going to talk about how to create a parent class first. So we're going to use the same example as the previous video where we were using the class person. Okay. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's type that out. And what we're going to do is we're going to type in class person colon and then definition is going to be init. Okay, and then we're going to give a parameter. So we're going to do self again. And remember, you can name this whatever you want, but we're going to just do self. F name for first name. And then last name. Okay, I'll do a colon. And then we'll do self dot first name equals F name. Okay, self dot last name equals L name. Okay, and then we have def print name self. We'll do colon print self dot first name self dot last name. Use the person class and we're going to comment this out to create an object and then execute the print name method. Okay, x equals person, John, comma, doe. Okay, and then we're going to print that. So we're going to do x dot print name. Okay, and we should, it should display or run John Doe. Okay, so that's how you get it to um, pull the print name, okay, without having to call person. We just said print name. And said, so, okay, print name. <laughs> it's pretty cool. All right, now let's um, talk about, we'll just talk about how to create a, a child class. So to create a child, to create a class that inherits the functionality from another class, Send the parent class as a parameter when creating the child class. So what you could do is create a class named student, which will inherit the properties and methods from the person class. Okay, so we could do that like this. We'll do it down here. We'll do class student person. Okay, and then we'll do pass. Okay. I'm going to delete that. And then let's talk about, so now the student class has the same properties and, meth and, and methods as the person class. So use the student class to create an object and then execute the print name method. Okay. So now what we're going to do is we'll do x equals student and we'll do just one equal sign. Student and we'll do Josh. Olson. Okay. And then we'll do ink ink x dot print name. I'll run that and we have Josh Olson. Okay. So that's how you run it with that. Now, the next thing we're gonna talk about is the super function. So Python also has a super function that will make the child class inherit all the methods and properties from its parent. So what that does is and when you look at what we've been writing, okay, so we have all this here, then we have this right here, okay, 
Now we want to inherit. Okay, so we've done class student person, and then we passed, right? And then we did student print. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to add a couple things to this. So let's do um, class student person, and then we'll do def init. And we'll do self, first name, L name for last name, colon, and then we're going to use the super function. So super, and then period, and we'll do underscore init, F name, comma, L name. And let's run that and see what happens. Okay, so it still runs the same thing. But it's inheriting all the parameters and whatnot from above. Now, what we can add to that, and we have that here. So all it's doing is it's inheriting that. And there you go. So that's how you get it to work with the super function. Okay. So that is inheritance with Python. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.